Hello, everybody. Welcome in. It is pouring rain in my valley right now. Perfect for a cozy cottage decorating stream, right? Like, I hope that this rain goes away because it's kind of ridiculous. Uh, yeah. So today I want to obviously look at the premium shop. I already bought a couple of things, pretty much everything. I love the premium shop this week. It was so good. Um, but I want to work on this area over here and do a cozy cottage build. Unfortunately, it is just like raining a lot in my valley. So it kind of uh, is not very fun right now because yeah, it's just super rainy. Um, I did check my mailbox. I had to, I needed the moonstones. Let's see if it actually loads. I don't know. It's not empty. Where is, you go to events. So my Savannah style did pretty good. I got 4,000 moonstones and rank 988. That's not bad. Um, I was actually pretty happy with this uh, ranking, especially because I did the Savannah style dream snap, like at the end of stream, the last 20 minutes. Uh, and I did it so quick and it did really well. So I'm happy with that because the mini mouse one, I got 2,500. Yeah. And then this one, 2,500. So back to 4,000. I was pretty happy with that. If you guys want to watch that, I did turn it into a video, the Savannah style one. Um, you can't even see this house over here. Here we go. It's kind of ridiculous. It's so rainy right now. Uh, but yeah, I definitely bought the cute little heart palace in the shop. So here's the shop. It's called the pink castle and it looks way better <laughs> than it looks right now with the rain. Uh, but I bought everything and I made a little video if you guys want to see it, but this is, I got the adventurous Anna, which I'm super excited about because I love her braids. They're so cute. It's like classic Anna style. I just love it. And then I got the little lovebirds and they're actually really cute too. I like their little heart tail. And then obviously you saw I was wearing this. Like I had to get the classic fox. But this is really pretty and we'll just have to look at it when it's not raining in my... <laughs> it's not just raining in my valley right now. It is pouring so it's gonna make it kind of hard to decorate uh so right now i'm gonna go check on the shop instead <laughs> maybe it'll stop raining by the time that uh i'm done in the shop let's see I have that i have that for sure i've also been grinding did i have that yes pumpkins because yeah she need money so I've been trying to get as many pumpkins as I can. Let's go. Okay. I don't have this gray table. <laughs> I'll get that. And then this one. More floors. Oh, I actually really like this one. Pale rough plank floor. That's a good one. That one is really cute. And then here's a red carpet. Interesting. And then this one's pretty too. Mosaic tile. Cute. Um, okay. Got that. I need, I think I need the green one of this. I have the red and the yellow, but I need the green, I'm pretty sure. Which would be nice to have for summer and spring. Oops, no, I have those for sure. So I have those. I have this toilet. Yeah, I do. <laughs> I don't need the toilet. Ooh, I don't have this. That's actually really cute. Cub emblazoned dresser. Okay, we'll get that. Um, I don't think I have this desk. What is this desk? Oh, this is cute. A craft desk. <gasps> Ooh, I have a build that th I'm going to use this for. Actually, I might show you guys too real quick. I was trying to use all of the... How do I not have these? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I do. I was trying to use all of the Bell's bundle. Um in a room build and where did I put that oh yay it's not raining oh my gosh finally that was so bad it was like pouring pouring where did I put that build 
I think I put it in Belle's house. Let me show you guys. I was gonna turn it into a video, but I haven't edited it yet. Anyways, I have this little craft area over here. So obviously I gotta put down that craft desk I just got. Cause it'll look way better than this desk. So we're gonna take off this stuff. Make that go away. It actually matches this whole area. That's exciting. Where is it? A little craft desk, it'll be at the bottom. Okay. Oh, that's cute. <gasps> I love it. Okay. Let's put the little... I don't need to put this back on now. We'll get rid of that. Oh, that's perfect. Yay. That's much, much cuter than that other table I had. And now it's like a full set in that corner. And that's really cute. So this is a little room I was working on. I was trying to make it like a little sleepover room. What is that? Is that my bird? Is it outside the window? <laughs> Look at that. My bird's like trying to get in the window right now. Um, yeah, I did a like a little sleepover room. I really like how it turned out. Those items are really cute from the Bell's bundle. All right, let's go back out to the meadow. So now you could see the house because it's not raining anymore, but it's such a cute house. I put it over here. I think I want to do a special like little garden build for it right over here in the corner um, all by itself because it's kind of like, it's like a, a centerpiece, you know? It's like such a good house. And then here's all my cozy cottages. I have to decide how I want to build this. First, I need to get all of the flowers. I already did this earlier, but they came back. I need to get all the stuff up so it makes it easier for me to build and I don't have to. There we go. I don't have to build around those, so we'll get those up. Now, okay. So I was kind of thinking like this little cottage, cozy cottage could be over here. I don't know if I've got too many of them. Like I'm wondering if there's too many kind of crammed in here. I might not use Gaston's house because all of these kind of match. These two, like all these have like purple and blue roofs and then that one is fine. But this red is kind of like throwing me off. So I wonder if I should just throw him off there for now. This is my house. So I'm gonna put that there. And this one is kind of like up on a hill with a tree. So I really want to angle it like so bad want to just put it at an angle right here, but I can't it won't do that. So we're gonna have to just put it back here It I had it over here, but it kind of didn't fit that well because there's just not a ton of room with the pond I don't know if, if I should move these forward a tiny bit. I have to figure out the pathing as well I did have one house right here, but I I don't know what to do right here. I kind of don't want to mess this up to where you can't walk through there. So let's look at pathing. I, I kind of want to use this leaf strewn path, but I don't have enough. I don't know if I'm going to have enough if I try and make more. What do I have a lot of? I do have a lot of the brick road, but I don't think that looks very like cozy meadow. I could do a muddy path too. I have the muddy path with border. That's probably not enough either. Hmm. Maybe I could do, I do have a lot of this natural rock. Let's see what that looks like. I think I'm gonna put the path down first and then worry about um, you know, trying to fill in the rest of it. Oh my gosh. Can I go this way? Okay. And then I, I choosing one without borders, but I think it's going to be okay. <laughs> Cause I think we're just going to fill it in with like greenery and stuff. I hate how I have to back out of the menu just to grab more of this path. 
Okay, and then this probably needs to be wider right here. Okay. And I can put bushes and stuff around that. And then I should make it go to this house. Here. Okay. And then go back. This one's not bad. I mean, it does look more like, it looks garden-like. I don't like how you can't get any closer to this house. But you really can't get any closer to that house right there. Oh, no, you can. Just kidding. Um, I should maybe make it wider, though. Pathing is the hardest thing. Okay. It doesn't match. Uh, because this is the muddy path, right? Is that the muddy path? So maybe I should do the muddy path. I didn't really realize that this house kind of has a built-in uh, path. I'm trying to make this go away. <laughs> Let's try the muddy path. I do have a lot of that. Is it the same color? Oh no, it's like so much darker. Okay, so this house is going to be the problem child, isn't it? Because that path doesn't look great. Huh. The sun baked? Is it the... I only have one of those. I can't even test that out. Um, I don't have any other path that would work. Maybe I don't have to do a path? Could I just do a natural path? Maybe I could carve a path out using bushes and stuff like that. Let's try that. I don't think I've ever tried that before. But I could just try and make like a little bit of a walkway like where I want people to walk and then just surround it with greenery. Let's try that. Uh, I don't think I want any bushes over there. Hmm. I could use, where's that grass? I never use the grass, this meadow grass in any of my builds, but I always see people use it. It does look really pretty. Let's just decorate around each house <laughs> and then we'll move out from there. I think that'll be, can I put that in there? Ooh, I can, I can fit that in. Oh, I really want to put another one right there, but I could do that. So maybe this will help me figure this out if I decorate around each house. Kind of. Do the same thing on both sides, I think. That one. Oh, this one. And that one. Not really lined up. So maybe I should push that back. Um, Actually, maybe... Oh my gosh, trying to fit this. Trying to get this to kind of line up a little bit. Oh, I sh maybe I should put this over. Scoot everything in. This is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to work out from each house because it's a really daunting task to kind of like, I don't know, just like think about, oh my gosh, I have to fill all this in. But if I just kind of work around each house individually, I think that's going to help me a lot. So let's go with trees. So wait, let's look at this tree. So this tree is kind of like that. I probably want more natural looking trees. I don't want any swamp trees. Oh my gosh, I love these so much. But I don't know if those will look right in the meadow. So maybe those are definitely more tropical too. Maybe we we'll just go with like classic trees. I don't know. Where... Hmm, maybe like these maples and stuff. I definitely want some trees back in the side. So there's the simple maple. Can I fit... 
Should I put a tree back behind there? What could I put back there? Hmm. Oh, I can also, I might just stick with the maples and the oak trees because those are actually the really pretty trees. Maybe I need a different color back here. Ooh, yeah. Oh, cool. I actually kind of like that. So if I'm going to stick with these trees, then that's all I'm going to use throughout the whole meadow. That way it keeps everything kind of like cohesive. Um, let's see, underbrush. And I could put some bushes back here on each side. Oh, you can't really get that close to that tree, so that's fine. That one. Um, let's start looking at some items. What did I want to use? Oh, I do want to use like the arches and stuff. But I don't think I want to put the arches around this house. I think I want to make a garden over here. Or actually, I want to kind of put a garden in the middle. Um, let's see. We need like a centerpiece though. So maybe we could find some kind of fountain or something. Where are all the fountains? <laughs> hmm. Maybe under decor. Okay, we've got that. Oh, this one. This is the fountain I wanted to use. It's so tiny. It is very tiny though, but... Okay, could we do two and like spread them out? Okay, is that kind of... Yeah, that's kind of in line. All right, we'll do two and we'll kind of spread them out. And we'll make like the center garden area. Oh, maybe that too. Let's spread these out further. If we're going to do that. Is that enough? Maybe. Okay. And then... Oh, I also have these, but I don't know. I don't know if I want it that manicured or if I want it more natural. Because I could also use, wait, it's under trees, the like hedges and stuff. But that would be very kind of manicured. I don't know, let's try it. I don't ever do kind of a manicured area. And then maybe some trees. Hmm. Which ones though? Like small? Oh gosh. Okay, we could do four of these. That one, should I do a leaning one or is that gonna look weird? Oh, that's another leaning one. <laughs> Hold on. I don't know about the leaning ones because it's really hard to see. <laughs> Maybe try and get more straight ones. Like, I like this one. If we could get... Okay, there's another, like, straight one. I can get rid of that leaning one. Oh, gosh. Every time I get a leaning one. Can I get a straight one again? Is that one straight? Yep. And... Okay... Oh no, this one's like super tiny. <laughs> it's cute, but I need another big one. Okay. That's cute. And then... Man, it's going to be hard to decorate now that I have the trees in there. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to see anything. Are those hedges lined up? Yeah, they are. Okay, we definitely got to put some like bushes and stuff around the clock. I'll probably stick with the same bushes throughout. Okay. Oh, I can't tell if these are lined up. Nope. <laughs> Definitely not. Let's scoot this one in. And then, oh, I was already in underbrush. I think I'm going to get more of this underbrush. Um, which one though? 
What does that look like? That's kind of cute. That big fan looking. <laughs> it's very hard now that I put the trees down. Maybe I should have waited, but I can't tell which one is not lined up. This one? Is it lined up or not? Maybe I just need to put more of these down. And it'll help me see. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's actually really cute. I feel like I do need a pathway, but I can't commit to a path right now. So I don't know if I just want to keep it natural or not. Okay, let's look through more items and see what else I have. I do want to add the arches somewhere. The ones that we got in the... Ooh, I have this gazebo. Does the gazebo... Does it... Okay, the gazebo just doesn't match the vibe, though, because it's not very cozy. It's kind of more elegant. So I don't think I want to do that, but I do like the gazebo. It's an option. We need some benches, but I made some. I made... Some bamboo benches. I thought those would be really cute. Uh, they're under seating. Maybe they're under seating? Somewhere. There we go. I made these. Oh gosh, they're kind of tiny, but... I could put them... How many did I make? I think I only made three. But it would be kind of cute if I made one more. And had seating all around this area. Actually, I need to scoot that. I'll probably scoot this one in. Probably get down on the ground. Here, let's go look. <laughs> it's always a good idea to get down and kind of look. Okay, this is looking really cute right here. It's kind of like a center piece to the meadow. But I do need one more bench. Oh, I have that little fountain too. The one that I just passed. I need to look at that too. Okay, furniture, let's go down. Hopefully I can make another one of those uh, bamboo benches. Where are they? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, does that mean I can't make it? What do I need? Oh my gosh, I need bamboo, okay. Let's go get some bamboo so we can make another one. The bamboo is in the, let's see, is it under foraging? No, which one is it under? I can't ever remember. It's not really an, oh, it's crafting, <laughs> right? No. How do I find it? Oh, it's an ingredient? Can you cook with it? I don't think I ever paid attention. Grasslands, promenade, and groves. So, up here. I think I needed like three. So let's get, let's find some. I guess I could maybe use my vacuum. That might be a lot faster. I love this thing. I don't know. This is like the best thing ever. Sweet. Look at that. And that's all I needed, right? Was three. The vacuum is the best thing ever. I don't have to search for anything. I can just vacuum up whatever I need. And I'm good to go. All right, we're going to make one more bench. And then I do have to figure out where to use those arches because I do want to use them. I also need some more, like, I need to put some flowers in. Make it look more garden-y. Oh, I made some of these clay jugs. I might hide those in the bushes. They look really cool. There we go. Okay, oops, I can't go out that way. Oh, these night thorns. I'm just leaving them just in case. But they are driving me crazy. <laughs> They're everywhere. But if it comes up in the star path again, 
I need to have them there. Okay, there's my bench. It looks so dark. Do you guys notice that? Like, the, here it looks like this light color, and then, oops, when you put it down, it's like a dark color. And I don't understand if that's... Is that a glitch? Did they mean for that to happen? Because I would... I mean, the dark actually does look good. But when you go to make it, you think that it's a light colored. Okay, we got to do something. Oh, I have two trees right there. <laughs> I didn't even notice. Look at that. I accidentally put two trees right there. We need to put some bushes and stuff around the bottom of the trees because they're just looking very out of place. Is this... I don't want this one to be a curved tree. Wait, did it not save earlier? You know how it does that when you... Because I definitely didn't have curved trees. I kept resetting until I didn't have a curved tree. <laughs> and then it put my curved trees back. We're going to have issues if the game decides to do that today. Because that's going to make it hard to decorate. Okay, hold on. There's, they're already dropping wood. <laughs> Let's see if it's saved. Okay, good. There's all of our straight trees. That's what I chose before. Okay, we got all of our straight trees. Now, I need... We need stuff around the bottom. Now, what should we do? Maybe I should do more of the meadow grass, too. Um, I might have to get my vacuum out because stuff is sprouting everywhere. We're already getting basil and stuff sprouting. Um, I don't know if I want to do any meadow grass right here, actually. Maybe not. Hold on. Let's get our vacuum out because it's going to cause issues if that is sprouting again. We need to clean everything up. Okay. Now I can decorate. Uh, should I get rid of this? <laughs> Maybe. I will need the mist, I'm sure. Trying to make a nether garden. The uh, advanced gardener. To make my pumpkin farming like easier. I have three up there right now. Where is this one? And I want to get one more. So I need to be getting missed. <laughs> I just forget to get on and get it. Okay, there's that. Hello? Where's this one? There it is. Okay. Let's add some stuff around the trees. Should I just do bushes? The problem is I'm going to want to like surround it and you can't because I want to be able to walk through here. So I need to do something that doesn't take up so much room. But we'll make the bottom of the tree look overgrown, you know? Maybe. Ooh, I want a different color. Everything is green right now, which is great. Springtime. But I kind of need different types of green or different colors. I could do some of these around the bottom. Maybe like three of those and then fill in. I could do rocks too. What rocks do we have? Just like little rocks. Really, we just have the small cluster, but I can't really make that work. Okay, maybe no rocks. Is there anything little... I could go around it? Maybe not. I could just leave it like this and then figure it out later. I feel like I need one more of something, though. Let's find... Huh. I already used... Oh, I used this one. I haven't used this one, I guess. 
Is that too much? <laughs> Wait, let's scoot that in. I mean, that's not bad. It kind of looks cute around the bottom. But can I recreate it? It doesn't have to be exact, I guess, because, you know. I don't want it to look too similar because it's supposed to be nature. And this one go there. And then I did this one. I don't know if I did three, but that's kind of cute. Yeah, I actually like that. I like covering the bottom, like the base of the tree. So let's do that again. Let's do that again on this side. Which ones did I use? This one. So we'll do three of this one. I feel like they need to be a little more spread out like that. And then I did this one. And fit a few of this in there. There. That actually looks really nice. And the blue goes really well because the houses are blue. Like they have a lot of blue in them. So I think incorporating some blue is going to be nice. That one. Can I fit one more? Ooh, maybe I should scoot over. I might scoot this blue one over just a little bit. Ah, <laughs> like that. Okay, that's actually looking really cute. I like surrounding the base of the trees with the little blue flowers and I feel like I should give these houses a similar feel maybe just to make everything kind of match okay that's cute and then my house I have pink bushes so Kind of struggling with what to do there. Because this house skin already has the pink. That doesn't look right. And this one is like, I don't know, that's like too pink. It's a little too much pink. <laughs> there are the butterfly flowers, which are also really cute. And maybe I should just add some in over here to make it look how close can I get it? Does that look like it's in front of the walkway? I mean, kind of. Uh, I can't really get... Why can't I put this one right here? Like, that one is there. I just want to put another one over here. Hmm. All right. Then we won't. We'll put it in front instead. That's cute. And then put these here. Okay, and I did want to put a swan in the water. I don't remember where that swan is, but I'm pretty sure that whole set is Hercules. Oh, you love this. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out cozy cottage meadow here. We're working through it. I for sure, I'm pretty sure it's Hercules. No, that's this stuff. But I do want to incorporate this. I just don't know how. Because we've got so much blue and purple going on right now. And this is pink. But I wanted to use these somewhere. I don't know. Maybe I could. Because I have one at the top of the stairs. Maybe I could put one at the bottom of the stairs. I got to figure out if I'm going to do a path or not. Oh, I wish I could angle this because... I would angle it and put one at the bottom of each of these steps. Ugh, I can't do that. Cannot do that. If we use this, we're gonna have to put more pink. We're gonna have to add more pink. What do I have that's pink? 
Let's look. Ooh. Hello? Cherry blossom trees? Okay. We could do this if we add more pink. So let's figure out. Yeah, they need angling so bad. Uh, so bad because I really want to angle this house. I wanted to put it kind of catty corner in that corner and you just can't do that. So no angling for us. Okay, I can't see anything because of these trees, but I'm going to put two more here and here. Okay, adding pink is helping. It's helping bring it all together. Yeah, that house would look so good angled because it's also up on a hill. So I was like, I would love to put it kind of in the corner, but it will not let you. Okay. Now I have to figure out... Oh, I wanted to find that swan. My goodness, I don't know where that swan is. But... Probably near the bottom. Is it in decor? Oh, there it is. I just saw it. Yay! Where can it fit? There. And then... Can I fit another one? Okay, maybe we just get rid of that. We don't need that. <laughs> Let's fit another swan in. Oh, so cute! The swans are so cute! I love them. Okay. That's turning out really nice. Um... What else? All oh, these fountains. I don't know wh what to do with these, but I did want to use them. They are just really small. Should I use these instead of this one? Oh, maybe. Actually, that looks really good because this matches the arch and it kind of goes well with the pink. And then this made it too much blue. Okay. All right, let's do that. We're gonna get rid of these fountains. We're gonna use the other fountain. I do like this one though. It has a little butterfly on it. It's really cute. I'll put that there. They look cute. You can't get enough token because of the new star path quests. Oh yeah. I know, they are really cute. Um, I'm still struggling with whether or not, I need more trees for sure, struggling with what I want to do if I want a pathway or not. <laughs> I can't decide. I feel like I need a pathway. Okay, we definitely need some more trees over there. I feel like we for sure need a path, but this, this like dirt leading up to the, the uh, house is really messing with any type of pathway. So I could do the classic rock path, you know, where, which one? Peaceful Meadow. We could just do the classical rock path. <laughs> we might have to do that because no path matches the muddy path is a different color mud. See? It's like dark. And then any of the brick paths don't look right. I wish, I kind of wish they didn't have that. <laughs> Classic is always good, yeah. Just go with how we used to decorate when we didn't have any paths. <laughs> we were very limited and we just made rock pathways all over the place. Which one did I grab? Oh, I grabbed the wrong one. So yeah, we're just going to go classic Disney Dreamlight Valley. I also don't think I have enough of any path to make it work. So, we'll do this. I had this all over my Forest of Valor. Like, back in the day. I actually probably still have some up there. Uh, this actually does look really nice. Ooh, I could fit one more in there. Good old 2020 do. Yep. The good old days. We were trying to make something work. 
Okay, that actually does look cute cuz that that screams cozy cozy cottage for sure. Just like natural cozy um cottage. I don't know what to do in this little space. But we're going to figure it out. <laughs> we're just having a very chill day Be decorating. I probably should have had like some background music going, but it's okay. It's okay. Um, do I want to carry it all the way around? Maybe this house needs a path. We've got a house over here. It doesn't have anything going on. I haven't done anything to it. Maybe I should. We'll just do... I should add some bushes in front of this one as well. Okay. What kind of bushes would look good for this house? This is actually really helping decorating out from the houses. Because... When I was looking at it before, it seemed very daunting. <laughs> but just moving out away from the houses is really helpful. And we'll just fill in as we go. Yeah, the bell house. Yep. And it's a library, so technically we could do a little library build next to it. I mean, I already have a library. I have Merlin's library. But you can never have too many libraries, so why not? Ooh, we need the bike somewhere. This bike for sure has to go out front. Maybe it'll fit. <laughs> you can't get that close to the house. Ooh, this rustic wood thing. Just have to set that down somewhere. <laughs> it just it just goes. Um let's see. What else? What else? Ooh, the cart. Okay, yeah, the cart is, like, cute. On the side? Oh, I wish I could put stuff in that cart. If I could put books in that cart, I would be so happy right now. You're going to make a giant library in the middle of Merlin's house? Yes! That would be pretty. That's what I did. I gave Merlin a library. I was like, Merlin has to have a library for sure. I'm going to have to buy more books because I don't have enough. I know I, know I don't. Ooh, there's a basket. I'm just grabbing anything that looks cozy. <laughs> there's a basket. Grab it. Okay, we got the basket. Um, it was a pile of crates. That's kind of cute. I can't cover back here, though. I got to make sure. Actually, before oh, clay jug, I should grab that. I need to make myself a pathway so I don't forget. If I don't do this now, I will cover these up. So we're going to do this now. There. <laughs> there we go. And now we can fill in around it. That'll be fun. Maybe some bushes. I want one of those jugs. Where was that jug? I need more flowers, too. Jug. Oh my gosh, it's huge. Wait. Is there a smaller one? I thought there was a smaller one. I grabbed the big one. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. It's just like clutter. We're just adding clutter. Oh, I have the rustic water pump. I should put this by my house because this is cute. Right here. Okay. I need to put a companion house out. Is this canoe? No, that won't really go with anything. Um, I need more trees around my house. Oh, that's so cute. I love the maple. I think the maple actually is one of my favorite trees. For this type of build, it's just perfect. I should put another one back here. Oh, it's going to look so pretty. My meadow was, like, really bad <laughs> before. This is going to be a cute little cottage corner. And then over here, 
I'm going to do some kind of, I got to do some kind of build with this new house because it's so cute. I'll figure something out over there. The little lady in the tramp date works as a feeder. Oh yeah, I don't have that yet. Actually, where is that one? Rewards. Uh, oh yeah, it's back here. Uh, I have 90. I don't think I can get there. I only have one item on here. Is it the next page? I might. If I do these two, like little ones. Hold on. Oh, wait. Cancel. Wait, I hit more tokens. I was like, why? Why are you trying to make me buy stuff right now? Okay, I should be able to get to the next page, right? Oh, <gasps> yes. Oh, my gosh. That's going to be so cute. Oh, my God. Thank you for telling me about that. I kind of forgot about that. I need to finish my star path. I have 40. Is there anything else that would work? No. Not right now. Oh, I should buy the coffee machine. <laughs> I've been wanting the coffee machine. It won't work in this build, but it's fine. Oh, the skirt's kind of cute. I should try that out. But companion house over here. Hmm, do I have a companion house? I don't know what they're under. If I could just search house, like companion house. I don't know if I have one. I feel like I do. I have one. I know it. I just don't know where it is. <laughs> no. Oh, well, here's this. Okay, I could do a little... Oh my gosh, this is so cute. <laughs> that is so cute. I can't get over it. We gotta put down a companion house, though. Is it under miscellaneous? Do I even have one? I don't even know if I have... Oh, yes, I do. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, wait. That's really, really cute. Okay, let's go put some little companions in it. I can't believe um, who Simba. should be... And he's alive. Who are my cozy cottage companions? Let's see. Maybe we should have the flowery capybara. Maybe one of the bunnies. Are they already in the meadow? I think they're already in the meadow, so maybe not. The s yeah, the bunnies are in the meadow and the squirrels are in the plaza. Who else? Who else is a cozy companion? Maybe just a bunch of capybaras. <laughs> Maybe just one. A fox would be cute. Meeting someone like you gives me um. Maybe we'll just oh Pua for sure. Maybe. <laughs> I think you have four, but we'll just do three. Oh my gosh! There they are. <laughs> They're so cute. I wonder if I should give them like a little fence. Is Nala back there about to pounce on someone? <laughs> she looked like she was going to pounce. No, Nala. No pouncing. Um, I do have these. I wish we had little fences, like short fences for our companions. That would be nice. Little tiny, little tiny white fence around them. Hmm. What am I looking for? It's not in there. Oh, Ross, hello. How are you doing? How are you? We're making a little companion area, I think. If I can find what I'm looking for. Where is it? But yeah, we for sure need tiny little companion uh, fences. <laughs> oh, I was thinking about this one, but I think maybe that's going to be... Uh, see, that's just going to be too big. I could use the white fence, maybe. I got the lady and trap table. Yeah, I just got it. The brain seer just showed me, or just reminded me about it. And I actually had enough. I was so excited. Maybe the white fence will work. 
I'm not going to cover the entire... We're not going to cover... I, I don't want to fence it all in, because then you can't see it. So maybe we just add a little bit. And then... Our companions need some... Some greenery around, right? Just going to stick with the same type of greenery everywhere. Um, put that one on that side. That's cute. I don't know if the water pump still makes sense, but it's fine. Where'd they all go? I guess they disappeared while I was decorating. <laughs> I guess they disappeared. Three days until Disney. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited for you. I can't wait to hear all about it when you get back. You're going to have so much fun. It's going to be awesome. You love the new bushes. Me too. They're so pretty. And you can really get them close in. I'm trying to decide. What do I want to put in front of the... What do we put in front here? Like that? <laughs> oh, you're going in August too? Cool. So many Disney trips this year. It's so fun. Um, We need anything else? I should have had background music <laughs> for you guys. Oh, we should give them a little plush. They need a toy. They need a little plushie back there. I'm going to figure out the background music. I used to have background music. And I was using a copyright free uh, track. And I kept getting copyright claimed. <laughs> so <laughs> I stopped using it. Because I was like, well, I keep getting copyright claims. It's not cool. Oh, I feel like we need this somewhere. Did that say wild coffee table? Is this, has this always been called wild coffee table? Is this con supposed to be a coffee table? I'm confused. I didn't know it said wild coffee table. Um, ooh, this is pretty. Right there. I should have one on each side. Okay. Oh, I need more of that underbrush. Oh, you're both going to the Paris one? Oh my gosh, that's so exciting. <gasps> that's so cool. I really want to go to the Paris one too. Okay. Ah. Why can't I get this one? The other one looks closer for some reason. Okay, that's fine. Let's see, I need some bushes back here. Bushes. Let's grab another peaceful meadow. Bush. And some more of this. Ooh, this one is tall. Yeah, I need a tall one. Oh, this is looking cute. What should I put on top of there though? Miscellaneous oak oh, candles, maybe. <laughs> I hope I get to go someday. I really do. I feel like I would love to go. It's a little bit of a trek for me <laughs> since I'm in America, but I think I would do it. I'm not a huge fan of flying. <laughs> So, get a little scared. But for Disney, maybe I'll do it. Maybe I'll do it for Disney, you know? Yeah, so I live in Florida. I live in Florida, so we get to go to Disney World a lot. I'm going to put this coffee cup there. Since that is called a coffee table, I'm putting the Monsters, Inc. just because I love it. I love the Monsters, Inc. We need more back here. 
Um, yeah, so we have um, season passes for, or the annual, I guess it's called the annual pass. We have the annual pass for Disney World. <laughs> You're moving in with me then? Yeah, right? Every weekend at Disney, I wish. I wish I could afford to go every weekend. It's definitely, it's definitely still expensive. I mean, the, having the pass definitely, it helps a lot. You get a discount in the parks and stuff. Ooh, would these fit right here? I don't know what I'm doing back there in the corner, but we're going to make some kind of cute little scene back there. <laughs> Last time we went was before COVID. Oh, yeah. It got canceled. I know. Everybody's trips got canceled back then. I think people are making up for it now. I think the last time we were there, it was so crazy busy. It was so, it was supposed to be an off time. Like it was supposed to be, when you look at the crowd calendars, it was not supposed to be like that. <laughs> and it was so busy. It was crazy. I wonder if the little picnic area will fit back here because that would be super cute. Which one? No, not this one. Pretty sure I have another one. Oh, yeah, this one. <gasps> Will it? Oh, it'll fit. Wait, which way? That way? <gasps> okay, that's going to be cute. Can I make a heart out of the lights? <laughs> You're thinking for the kids for Christmas gifts? Oh, yeah. That would be so fun. The Christmas just before COVID. <laughs> Oh, your Halloween trip got canceled too? You've been three times after COVID. See? Everybody's making up for it after COVID. They are. Everybody's traveling. Can we make a heart? Oh my God. <laughs> I don't know if you can see. It's kind of like a little heart with the lamps. A little date night spot back here. In the corner. Every penny you have goes towards it, right? For the food and, you know, obviously the hotel, the souvenirs, <laughs> all of it. Okay, let's get down to the ground. You can't get back here. Oh, can you? If I move that bush, you might be able to, but I don't need to get back there. I just need it to be cute. Oh no, is our fox going to be stuck over there? No, he's making his way. He's making his way. Nala's stuck. So good to see you. Is Nala babysitting right now? She's stuck. <laughs> oh, Nala. I'm so sorry. We might have to get her with a tree so she can go. Okay. Let's let Nala out. She was stuck babysitting all the little creatures. Okay, that looks cute. I want to see what it looks like at night. The parks are packed. Yeah, it is kind of crazy. <laughs> Want to swap valleys. Oh. <laughs> oh, Ross, do you know I bought it? I for sure bought the... I couldn't handle it. Oh, look. That is the cutest little area. I love that. Okay, that turned out... That turned out cute. Okay, finally, things are coming together. I feel like at the beginning of a build, you're kind of like scared. <laughs> it's like, is this going to come together? I don't know. But it's finally starting to come together. <laughs> okay, let me look. Here's the castle. Look at it. It's worth it. I think it's totally worth it. So it has petals falling off of the sides. And these little bushes, look at the hearts coming off of the bushes. Like what? Let me show you at night. Look at it. And all the hearts in the windows. Oh my gosh, it's good. It's so beautiful for the price. 3000 It's very detailed. There's like ivy growing around the back. There's a door on the side. 
I kind of want like this flower right here. I want that to be an item in the game. I want all of this to be in these bushes to be an item. It's really pretty. It's super pretty. I put it over there for now. I'm going to do a build with it. I just don't know what yet. <laughs> I'm for sure going to do something with it. Okay, let's go back. Thank you guys for liking the stream. I hope you're enjoying yourself. <laughs> it's a very chill stream today. I just wanted to decorate. Let's pick that up. What else should I use? Oh, I know what I wanted to use. I want to go to Eternity Isle. And I can't remember. Where are those little bird bushes? These. So these little bird things look really cute when you set them on the ground. Split and drop. Look at that. They look so cute, and I saw somebody use those in a build, so I wanted to get some. I have more right here. Oh, you're enjoying yourself. Yay, I'm so glad. <laughs> I'm so glad. Just chilling and chatting. We're just decorating. Okay, I think, did I get enough of those little birdies? I actually don't know if I have any more. Oh, up here, up here. Look at this, I got a bunch of them. <laughs> I never come up here. Ooh, I need this for the star path, hold on. <laughs> I need orange gems for the star path. And this uh, ever gem, that counts, so. If I see it, I gotta get it, okay. I don't think we have any more of those little flowers up here. Let's go back. I want to decorate with them. I saw somebody do it. It was so cute. Yeah, they're little birds. <laughs> and they look really cute when you set them down. So, we got to figure out where we want to put them. I think I just want to, like, hide them. Um, oh, I got eight of them. Let's hide them. They kind of look like Easter. Like little peeps <laughs> for Easter. If you set them on a table, that might be cute. Because they look like little peeps. Uh, okay, drop. Let's drop them all. And... <laughs> got our little peep army going. Let's get our little peep army. Can it fit? Like, he just looks cute sitting there. I don't know. That's just cute. Right there. <laughs> Around the snuggly duckling. Yes. Okay, there has to be some. <gasps> Look, you can kind of get them in the rocks. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Can I get one here? Uh, we should face them a different way. And I want some in front of my house because they're kind of cute. <laughs> Look at them. You could just tuck them in. Like, they're great. Like, little filler. They add a little bit of color. Little filler birds. I don't know. Can I fit one in here? Right there. I'm always looking for filler items. Like, stuff you can get in close. Because there's always, like, little areas that you need... Something. And this is a great way to do it. Okay, where should this one go? This house, I'm neglecting this house over here. <laughs> I'm kind of neglecting this one. What should I do over here? Is Can I put anything else in between? Um. Oh, you know what I did make? I, I pre-made some stuff the other day. Because I was anticipating this build. And I was like trying to make everything that looked cozy. <laughs> and I made these. Where are they? Ah, these Adirondack chairs. Look at those. Why have I not used these anywhere? So, it's Adir Adirond how do you say that? 
Adirondack? Adirondack? Uh, probably not saying it right. I should put a little cafe, or not a cafe, but like a little... We need a little, like, uh, picnic area. <laughs> oh, you made a reel of all your Disney outfits? Okay. I'm definitely going to check that out. <laughs> I can't wait to see. You're definitely not over the top. There's plenty of people that do tons and tons of fun stuff for Disney, like dressing up. We've done... We've done like matching shirts where we all wore the same shirt, you know, and it said like Disney vacation and the year, <laughs> like that kind of stuff. We've done that. It's fun. I always try to theme my shirt to the parks. So like for going to Hollywood Studios, I wear Star Trek or Star Wars, not Star Trek, <laughs> not Star Trek, Star Wars shirt. Oh, this would be cute. I kind of... It is so much fun to do. It's fun to just like be over the top. And you know what? Everybody does it. So <laughs> you don't feel out of place. Like everybody's kind of dressing up. So it's totally fine. I don't know what we're doing over here. Some kind of seating area. I don't know what. Gotta look at the rugs. Yeah, your outfit matches the restaurant or the theme. Perfect. That's what we do. But then I need to buy more shirts because I wind up wearing the same shirts. <laughs> the same Star Wars shirt every time. And then... That's kind of cute. I don't know if I want to leave that. And then all my vacation pictures look the same because I'm wearing the same... <laughs> I like wind up having the same shirt on. You get a Tom item that none buyers don't have. Oh, the Starlight bundle. Wait, what item? I do have that bundle. Wait, what's a Tom item? What do you mean, Tom? <laughs> what does that stand for? Am I not thinking correctly? What did we get in that bundle? I did make a little, uh, I don't know, I'm kind of liking this rug. Maybe. We'll see. We'll leave it. Oh, touch of magic. Oh, touch of magic. I honestly forget about touch of magic. How do we even do it? Uh, add new. Oh, the lounge chair. That's new. Ah. Okay. Uh. Oh my gosh, you know, I haven't done a touch of magic since, oh my God, a mushroom chair. <laughs> oh my gosh. I haven't done touch of magic since it came out. <laughs> oh, I want a mushroom chair. How do I get it to cover everything? Ah, no, go back. Wait, how do I do this? Shapes? No, nature. I was looking at nature. Okay, and then you go like this, and then, oh my gosh. Does it not cover the back, though? How do I, okay. <laughs> I'm so bad at this, because I honestly have not used the Touch of Magic. Um, Can you not cover the back side of the chair? Is it only the front? It looks like it's only the front. Okay. Uh, where'd my... Where'd they go? What's going on? <laughs> What's going on? Does the back stay white? <laughs> yeah, I need to... Uh, I need to figure it out. Because honestly, like... I haven't used it. I think the main reason I didn't use it is because every time you do a dream snap, you basically have to put it away, right? Wait, is that cute? <laughs> okay. 
Do I need a different color? How do I change that? Glossiness? Wait, can I? Hello? Oh, here's the colors. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Wait, should we make a brown mushroom chair? <laughs> uh, how do I change the back? I wish I could get this pattern all over, though. I mean, is that as small as it goes? How do I... Uh, okay. Yeah, that's as small as it goes. I mean, come on. What? <laughs> Muddy color, I know. <laughs> it is kind of muddy. I don't know what other color would look good. Oh, the pink is kind of cute. Um, what cozy cottage doesn't have a mushroom chair? <laughs> this is kind of the perfect thing. I don't know what other color goes with mushroom. Oh, the dark red actually does look good. The dark red with the brown? Okay, so now what? Save and quit. And now I have the item. Oh, I have a mushroom chair. <laughs> ah. Okay. We made a mushroom chair. Wait, how do I get this? Why won't I carry? Maybe we should get rid of this rug. I don't know where to put it. It keeps setting it down. Which is kind of annoying. Hello? It keeps setting it down. I'm just trying to move my mouse. <laughs> Okay. Okay, we'll just put it over here. I have a feeling I'm going to have to get rid of it because when I do my dream snap, it's going to cause it to mess up. Because that's why I never did it because I had a dream snap and it was like, please remove your touch of magic. But it was literally all the way across the valley and it kept picking it up. I could do a matching rug. We could just have a whole mushroom room, apparently. <laughs> it keeps destroying the rocks. I know. It kept setting it down when I was trying to move it. It was, like, automatically setting it down. And I was like, no. I need to put them all back. There. That's fine. Yeah, it'd probably be better inside. This looks better without a rug. But I need to put something on the table... What would our people be eating? <laughs> Can I sit? Oh, are you going to sit in my mushroom chair? No, she's not. She's like, that thing is ugly. I'm not sitting in that. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Okay, we'll leave it for now. I might move it because it doesn't match. It doesn't match our area, but that's cool. That they gave us a touch of magic item. Oh, the leaf frogs. You're right. I wish I had the green one, so I don't have the green one. I have a yellow. I know I have red, but I'm pretty sure it's in my house. I mean, yellow would be cute. They need something. They need a rug. But I definitely need to give them some food or something on the table. And maybe some light. It would get dark over here at night. We need some kind of... Okay, if I'm going to choose a light, I have to stick with it. Kristen, hello. Welcome in. Oh, if you ever get the green one, tell me. Yeah, I've been looking for the green one. And I haven't had it. These are kind of cool. These are kind of a vibe right here. They do look very... Oh, this tree. <laughs> this tree's going to make me rage quit can't see through it <laughs> oh my gosh okay here <laughs> trying to get in a position where you guys could see uh hello okay let's just get down there we go how do those look at night those look very co cozy to me okay we definitely need something behind though Let's move it back to the daytime. And what should I put back there? Just some bushes, maybe. Cozy bushes. 
Probably. I feel like I need more items. But I don't know what to put. Oh, there's already, this tree's already dropping sticks everywhere. Okay. <laughs> I still can't decorate around this other tree. This is cute. I want to, I want to be right here right now. Can, can someone just put me inside the game, please? <laughs> it just, it looks very like, I don't know. Just want to sit there with some iced tea. I want to sit right here with a big tall glass of iced tea. Um, that's cute. Bushes to hide the sticks, yeah. Oops, I don't want to grab that. Yeah, we don't want those sticks. Meadow grass is too big. But maybe just like out front. You yeah, know? It's a little overgrown over here. This is also too big. We need other small stuff. Should I put one of those jugs over here? I feel like there was a smaller jug. Okay. There was a smaller jug, I know. Okay, these, I'm just gonna grab these sticks because I don't think it'll let me put anything back there. I can't, I can't with the tree. Oh, look at all the butterflies. Come on. These butterflies were the best addition to this area. I feel like I need something tall back there. Yeah, the jug would be good. Where was that? Miscellaneous? I actually don't know. It might be in our decor. We just need to throw... The jug was tall too, wasn't it? So maybe it'll look... Oh yeah, just kind of layered back in there. I don't know, I feel like I need something else over there, but I don't know what. <laughs> huh. Oh, I also have these stands. I want to make a little area for like a little market. I had a market at one time. I don't know. Let's just see what that looks like. <laughs> this is kind of just a cute little area. I don't know. I need to put something on the table, though. Look at that. Why can't I take a picture like this? I mean, I could take a screenshot, but the picture mode, if we could just sit, it would just be really pretty. Okay. Uh, let's figure out what we want to put on the table. Okay. What should we... They don't have iced tea. It makes me sad. If they had a big tall iced tea... You know what? We do have... Oh, I have tea. No, but I have... Oh my gosh, I don't even know what it's called. We got the little tea set, didn't we? Like, a long time ago. <laughs> I have just no idea where it is. Um, was it the Mad Hatter tea set that we got? Do I have it decorating somewhere? Tempted just to go to Scrooge and just buy something? I need to put these, more of those out there. And probably more of these trees, the cherry ones. No? Huh. I'm actually not sure what that would even be under. Do you guys know what I'm talking about? It was like a Mad Hatter tea set or something. That we got. It was a while ago. It'd be really cute sitting on the table. Okay. Where is that? <laughs> Don't you hate it when you can't find an item? Like, you know... You know of an item in your brain. But you don't know where it is. 
That's why they really need a better search option. Okay, he's not in here, so we're just gonna have to do that. So he'll come in here. Thank you kindly. All right, here we go, searching for stuff. <laughs> Was it okay? Maybe I could wait. Let's go to all. And then filters. It was Alice in Wonderland, right? No? What was that little tea set? Oh my gosh, I swear. Am I thinking of... Am I not thinking of the right thing? I could have swore we got like some kind of little tea set that's set on a table. Oh, I don't have any Alice in Wonderland items. I mean, this is stuff you buy. So maybe it wouldn't be here. It wasn't Beauty and the Beast, was it? Because we have that one. Um, oh, I forgot about this bed. This bed is really cute. Was it Beauty and the Beast? So was it... How come it's not here? I have this one. But I could have sworn there was one you could set on a table. Maybe it's the other Beauty and the Beast of 2017. No. <laughs> Let me look in my inventory, bye bye. and then I might just give up. Oh wait, I can't do that in here. Yeah, no, I could have swore we got one that you set on a table, but I could also just be <laughs> not thinking. Maybe we did it. <laughs> No. I'm going to try one more. Oh, it's in Disney. Um, gosh. Okay, well, maybe not. <laughs> Was it in a star bath? Hmm. I don't remember what that item was. I'm going to have to think about it. But I could have swore we had some kind of like little tea set. And it was like small and you set it on a table. This is looking cute though. Look at the swans. The swans are looking really cute. I want to try and put... I still have... I have 200 of these lanterns, guys. The small quirky teapot. Okay. Yeah, see? There was an item, right? Where is it? In Disney? Can you filter by... Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the one I'm talking about. But I just don't know how to find it. <laughs> or if I... I might have it sitting out somewhere and I can't even find it if I wanted to. <gasps> oh, Disney. There is a Disney filter. So there's that. I don't have it here. Where did I put that item? All right, hold on. Let's talk to Scrooge and we'll give, we'll try one last time. <laughs> I must have set it out somewhere. Da, 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 da. Why is he not in here when I need him? Greetings, neighbor. I need Thank you. Okay. Uh -huh. We're going to try one last time. Furniture. I'm going to go to all filters and Disney. Disney. No. It's not under that. That's going to drive me crazy now. <laughs> That's going to drive me crazy. Would it be under miscellaneous? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's pretty much going to drive me crazy now. Because <laughs> I, I don't feel like I've ever decorated with it, but maybe it's it's obviously somewhere in my valley right now. Well, we won't have that sitting out. Maybe we'll just put like a little coffee. Yeah, you thought it was. I mean, I thought so too. I can't remember where that tea set is. And see, that's why we need, like, a better search option in this game. Because it is really hard to search. 
it's really hard to search for stuff. Okay, what are what are our people doing? They're not drinking iced tea because we don't have iced tea. So maybe they're having a mocha or just a coffee. Could you a mocha on that table? And they need a snack. What are they eating? Cheese platter? Crackers? <laughs> I could go for coffee right now. That sounds really good. What would be cute sitting out? That's what we got to look at. A little cheeseburger. Um, I always like the cheese platter. I think that one's really cute to have sitting out. Doo -doo. Sushi. That makes me hungry. I want some sushi too. Uh, they could be having dessert. Cookies. I love the chocolate chip cookies. They're really cute. Okay, maybe our people are having coffee and chocolate chip cookies. Because that sounds like a good time. <laughs> Sitting out there. Alright, let's go set that stuff down. Do I have that teapot in here anywhere? No. See, I always put the cheese bladder out. I love it. What's over here? No? Okay. It's fine. Totally fine. Let's go put it down. I don't know if I want to leave these flags up or not, but... Where's my coffee? Oh, there it is. But I'm going to leave them up for now. Okay. We got our chocolate chip cookies and our coffee. That's cute. That's fine. This is our little cute spot so far. Alright, what else did I want to put out? Maybe more of those pink trees. Um, I feel like this area is lacking. Maybe some more underbrush right here. Just a little bit. I need more like filler items. I'm never as good at the filler stuff <laughs> as some people. Some people are really good at it. I need to get more of the like natural stuff like the barrels. All of that is really good for filler. There's a crate. <laughs> Could just have a crate somewhere back there. Oh, I do have these flowers too. Can that fit? Oh, it's that grass. Let's move that grass back. Ooh, I have to get rid of the grass. Well, we can move the barrel. That. And then I want to use... I need more flowers, so... Oh, those flowers match what's on the Snuggly Duckly. You just bought 999 floating lights. You could cover an entire biome in them. That's what I did. I bought a ton of those floating lanterns. I just covered the whole biome. Just for fun. <laughs> uh, oh no. I don't know what you're going to do with them. It only took 204 to cover this the meadow. <laughs> so with 999, you might be able to cover your entire map. <laughs> the entire like Eternity Isle, probably. Let's see. It's looking very cluttered, but I don't mind it. Clutter is nice. Oh, this is so pretty too. Oh, I don't know. Maybe I should get rid of this. Cover most stuff, yeah. You'll just be able to cover everything with it. I still haven't decided what to do over here. Um, pumpkins. Oh, this little bench. I love this bench. It's so pretty. Because it sparkles. Oh, there could be a little bench right here. That's kind of cute. 
Oh, this water bucket. Got to get this water bucket in there. We're just grabbing everything. Grabbing everything. Um, oh, these. I did want to put more of these somewhere. Three again. Okay. I can't move that now. It's fine. Okay. I want to put something on the sides of this bench. I still have more of these jugs. I could have sworn there's a smaller jug. I need to look. Pretty sure there's a small jug. Okay, we gotta get rid of our mushroom. It just doesn't match. <laughs> but it was cute to do. Um, I need to get these sticks. I need to get rid of those sticks. I don't like them. And then, oh my gosh, I love the swans so much. Okay. Oh, I wanna put something on the other side of this bench. What should I put? Flowers? We need more flowers. Like, more flowers in this menu, the underbrush menu. Not just the flowers that spawn, because I guess technically there are a lot of flowers <laughs> in the game. If you count all the ones that spawn. But I would love to have more flowers to decorate with. All these sticks everywhere is going to drive me crazy. But it's fine. Okay, this is looking so cute. Look at the butterflies. I love the butterflies everywhere. Okay, maybe we'll get half the meadow done today. And then, yeah. <laughs> I could do the other half another time. Where we work on the, the new pink castle. We gotta find a build for that. I'm looking for another jug. I thought for sure, I thought we had a smaller jug. And now, maybe we don't. Maybe it's just that big one. Oh yeah, this one, the tall clay one. Pink luminescent flower. This is the one, oh, and these baskets. Okay, I need to go to Eternity Isle because I need to put some of these baskets around in that jug. I can make fiber. Whoa, I don't want to make that many. We'll just make 30. And then we need to go pick some flowers. <laughs> you searched up the teapot and it's right. It's in Disney. Oh, you didn't find it either? Did they remove it? I wonder if they removed it. Because it has been a really long time since I've even, like, looked at that item. <laughs> I just thought of it just now. They must have removed it. How sad. Didn't they give that to us in our mailbox or something? For, like, a prize? I can't remember. I can't remember how we got it. I feel like they just gave it to us. And then they just removed it. <laughs> so... Maybe something was wrong with it. I remember it being a really cute little item. How sad. Well, no cute little teacup or tea set. Um, what do I need for that jug again? The pink luminescent one. Yeah, they gave it up for a challenge and it was in the shop. Yeah. That's weird. Well, I guess it's gone now. <laughs> I wonder if anybody noticed. We're just like the only ones that noticed? Or maybe they did it a long time ago and I just never heard about it. What is that? Mist is stuck in the tree. You placed it in your amusement park and it's still there. Oh, so you can't buy it? It's just like if you placed it, it's still there, but you can't find it if you took, picked it up. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't know if there's any more of these flowers. Oh my gosh, this bird is so cute. Look at how he dives. 
He has a little heart tail. You have three in your amusement park? Okay. That's so weird. <laughs> the mystery of the teacup <laughs> item. Uh, see, this is the stuff I should be making. Like that. A little birdhouse. Um, could decorate with these, like, this sack right here. A stack of wood. Like, all this is, like, cozy cottage stuff that I forget about. Oh, the stone well. You decided to delete one and see if you could buy it, and it still can't. So they must have removed it, but if you have it in your valley, it stays. Yikes. Well, don't ever put them away. <laughs> because if you put them away, it might disappear. You may never get it back. I need more of those. Huh. The pink luminescent flower. I don't have enough of those. Where is it? Uh, this one? The ruins in the overlook. That's where I am. Bummer. Maybe I should just pick up all the flowers. So, more pink ones will spawn. So I can make more of those jugs later, because I kind of want to have a few of those, not just one. Okay. Now more stuff should spawn. Let's go back to the valley, peaceful meadow. I won't put down, I gotta remember what I made. <laughs> What did I make just now? I know I made the jug, so probably in her decor. Oh, I made this birdhouse. Yeah, ask more about it, see if it's just us. Yeah. Maybe uh maybe we should send a message to Gameloft and just be like, hello. <laughs> Can you give us this item and it's gone? I'm just not good at cluttering, guys. <laughs> I'm not very good at cluttering. I don't know. I mean, it's okay looking. I feel like other people do it so well. What else did I have? I think the key is probably using very similar items. And I tend to grab everything. <laughs> I'm like, oh, that's cute. That's cute. That's cute. <laughs> and then I wind up with too many different items everywhere. So maybe that is the problem. <laughs> Do I need the basket? <laughs> okay, yeah. Find out. If you, if you send them a message and they respond, let me know. Because I... I would be curious to know what's going on because I don't have the item at all and I know I had it. Okay, this basket doesn't work. <laughs> I know I had that item. This is taller than I thought. I thought this one was shorter. This is also a very tall jug. <laughs> uh, that's fine. Okay, maybe no more baskets. Um, ooh, my allergies are getting to me. My nose is like stuffy. <laughs> I love allergy season. Okay, I I I'm putting too much stuff. I gotta I gotta reel it in. <laughs> more nature and less stuff. Let's get in some more nature. Like bushes and stuff. Because too many items looks... Doesn't look as good. Okay. That there. I need more of these flowers, maybe? Man, I want to put those close, but I can't. Right there. 
And then actually maybe a short guy right there. Oh, why did that go back? I thought I put that away. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. <laughs> We're just cluttering it up now. We're adding all kinds of stuff. We'll make it look good. You can put stuff on there, but I don't know if I want to. I don't know. Oh, I love that, but that's too fall. Possibly too fall. Um, I don't know if there's any more in there. I feel like I made more stuff and I forgot about it. But, oh, this, the well. Okay, wait, we got to figure out. So there's this awkward area. I don't know what to do yet. It's a very hard area because there's an intersection between this ramp and that ramp, so you can't really cover it. You need to have a little walkway, but maybe I could put this in the middle and have, I haven't used any of these type of bushes. Let's see what we want to put around our little well. We need to move that stick. And then, uh, maybe that's too tall. Maybe a short guy. Yeah, this spot is kind of annoying because it's like you can't cover it up. You need to have it open. But what do you put there? <laughs> what do you put there? Oh, this guy's little. This little orchid base. He's kind of small. He could fit in there. Right there. Okay. I feel like I want to extend the path now. Wait, not that path. Our classic rocky path. Let's extend it out. Wait, where is the... This one? We're going to bring it over. Oh, I forget to rotate them every now and then because you want to make them look different. Okay, we're going to give ourselves a path and then maybe just put some bushes. Possibly. Okay, we got to like thicken the path right here. Bring it over here. We're just putting all these rocks everywhere again. Okay, so now we've given ourselves a path and now maybe we could fill it in with some bushes. Like along the path. Okay. Giving ourselves a little bit better. You know what? I need to get rid of this guy and put this one in. Okay, it's not bad. Uh, we need to fill in all of this. What should we fill it in with? Maybe more of these. Man, I am going classic, classic Disney Dreamlight Valley. Bushes, rocks, and these butterfly flowers. <laughs> I'm just loving this. Uh, loving that stuff right now. Maybe. Uh, we're just going to fill it all in. I think we're just going to fill it in. This guy is... No. Okay, I shouldn't introduce any new plants. Because I've already chosen the plants we're going to use. And... We want to stick with that. To have like a cohesive look. Wait, not that one. Maybe this one. Okay, there we go. It's just like a little bit of a garden. This little stick is bothering me. <laughs> um, should I add anything else around here? Or maybe I, maybe I could fit more of the stones in. Where are the rocks? Do, do, do. 
Maybe we just thicken up the rock pathway. <laughs> yeah, the circle's working. It gives us a guide to where we're going to walk. But it fills in this, like, awkward... <laughs> We're just filling it with rocks. We're, it fills in this awkward space. Now, I wonder if I can put a few little bit of underbrush in there. Just like a few of these guys that it just overgrew a little bit. Although that might be annoying because when you walk, I'm pretty sure you can't walk through those. Okay, we got to get down. <laughs> We got to get down. I also need to fill in or decide if I'm going to fill that in. Okay, this is not looking horrible. Okay, I don't know where all the companions are. They kind of are getting stuck, but it's fine. Are they really getting stuck over there? <laughs> Hopefully they can figure that out. Oh, this looks actually good from the ground. I might move that though, cause that, I'm gonna hit that. I'm gonna hit that. So, goodbye. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, cause I'll just hit that. Okay. Oh, I should extend it a tiny bit because, um, rocks. We do need to connect it, and then I want to put some kind of underbrush. Okay. A bush? No. It's too much. Maybe one of these tall things. This one? Uh, maybe? Okay, let's get down here. Okay, that's not bad. And now I can get to the mining spots. Okay. This area... Is fine. That's a lot of rocks. <laughs> That's a lot of rocks, you guys. I guess it's fine. That is a lot of rocks. <laughs> and then when you go this way, I mean, this just looks really cute right here. Oh, my characters can get back there. Okay. Come over here. All right. Our little cozy cottage area is looking cute. You can never have too many rocks. We got a lot. There's definitely a lot of rocks going on right here. I wish I could maybe... I feel like what we're lacking is some height. Some height over here. So, can I get rid of this bush? Maybe I could put a tree right there. Is there a skinny tree? Tall black maple? <gasps> yes! Okay. That's a little bit better. I, I think that's what I'm lacking right now is height in this area. It's just everything is very open. There's nothing going on. Okay, I want to fit a tree somewhere. Maybe I get rid of this fan plant and just... Can I fit a tree in there, please? <laughs> please let me put a tree. Ah, the tree stayed. I, I mean, I could put a tree behind this house. Right there. I want to put a tree right here, but I don't know if that's going to... Will that guy fit? Okay. Okay, that's helping. That's helping me a lot. I just feel like there wasn't enough heights going on. We definitely needed trees. What happened to... Didn't I have a tree right there? Oh, that's right. Nala got stuck. I forgot about her. She got stuck and I had to move the tree. Which tree should I do? Um, Maybe the... Oh, yeah. That one. Okay, there's our tree back. Kind of forgot about that tree. Definitely helps having trees. Yeah, that's what we were lacking is some height in this area. You could also put a tree right here. A tree centerpiece. Um, I think that would help a lot too. Do, do, do. Just going to fill in some more. Oh, I already have a flower. I think my toxic trait is I don't know when to stop. 
And it's like gonna keep filling in. We're gonna keep filling it in. I want more rocks because <laughs> we don't have enough. Not enough. I might change the rocks someday. I might do like a path, but it's fine. The rocky path is cute. The rocky path is cute. <laughs> Same, you don't know when to stop. I know. It's like I just I just keep adding stuff. And then I'll come back to it tomorrow and I'll be like, um let's get rid of like a bunch of this stuff. But it's fine. For now, okay, that helped a little bit. That little tree right there helped it not just be a giant rock wall. And this tree, and it adds shade, which looks nice. Okay. Okay, this looks cute. That looks better over there too, with the trees. <laughs> you use 2,000 items for your meadow because you couldn't stop. I mean, I think, is the meadow the biggest area we have? I mean, because the glade is broken up by that, like the river. So is Sunlit Plateau. Forgotten Lands doesn't seem that big. The forest is broken up. Yeah, so the meadow is just this giant, huge rectangle, so it's kind of hard to decorate. It's very hard to decorate down here. Okay, well, we've got our centerpiece. I like this little area. I don't like all the sticks everywhere, but that's fine. We have to have the sticks. I do like how the cozy cottage I need to talk to you. area is coming around here. It's looking better than it used to. Twilight, hi, hello. It's okay, you could be late, that's all right. We're working on our cozy cottage. Although I have been streaming a lot longer than I usually do. So I do have to get ready to go. The swans are my favorite part. I don't know. The swans and then these little like duck flowers sitting everywhere. I definitely need maybe more flowers. I gotta figure out this area is kind of empty. My dream snap. Um, I did, I got 4,000 moonstones. Can I get to this mailbox? <laughs> I got 4,000, which is so funny because I rushed that dream snap. I did not put that much work into it. I mean, I took like 20 minutes at the end of stream to do that one. And of course, it's the one that gets 4,000. And then my other one's got like 2,500. <laughs> you got 4K too? Yay! Uh, yay, we needed that 4K because well, there was too many things in the shop. This cute castle, the backpack, like everything. Are you late or are we early? <gasps> Oh man, I wish I could stream for like three or four hours, but I can't. I am a stay-at-home mom. <laughs> My teenager's helping with the little kids while I stream, so I try to not take a really long time so that he doesn't have to like watch them for too long. I'm just walking around. I'm still walking around to look at everything. Uh, you spent most of it. Yeah, I'm at 28. Well, I did buy some. Ugh, I bought some. I told myself I wasn't ever going to buy any. <laughs> but I bought the cheapest pack because I needed just a little bit more. The Heart Castle is really good. We'll do a build for this one. We got to figure it out, but I think we could tie it in. Because over there I've got pink... I got pink bushes and stuff and blue and this house is pink and blue on it. So we'll be able to tie this in and make it kind of match. Now Gaston's house probably has to go. I think his house is going to have to go. I was going to add him to the cozy cottage, but he actually with his red roof does not match this area. See everything over here is blue and natural. And then he was like red. You're waiting to get the bell bundle. Oh, it's so good. The bell bundle is really good. I'm going to put him back. Where did I have him? 
did I have him up here? I thought I did. Maybe that ice spawned while I had him. I think that ice spawned. I'll have to remove that ice <laughs> before I could put him. Or I could put him back in Eternity Isle. But unfortunately, his house just didn't. It didn't. No, oh, Wally, hello. It didn't uh, have the vibe. Oh, this, like, come on. Okay, I'm going to take my dream snap over here. I haven't even looked. Wait. Current challenge. Uh, outfit challenge. Fur, feathers, and scales. Create an outfit inspired by your favorite pet in the valley. <gasps> cute. Okay, that's going to be a cute, cute challenge. Uh, cute, playful, casual, familiar. Okay. Well, I'll have to work on that. I'm not going to work on that today, but... I could take that over here somewhere. I'll have to use my cute backdrop. I actually just like this right here. <laughs> Keep it simple, right? Keep it simple because that seems to do the best. All right, I'm loving this meadow. Okay, guys. Well, unfortunately, I do have to get off stream, but I am so glad that you hung out with me. What is she looking at? Oh, she's looking at Woody. <laughs> She's looking at Woody. Let's get her to look at you guys because I don't have a, a webcam today. There we go. Uh, oh, you already did your dream snap. Oh my gosh. What what uh, animal did you choose? I was thinking about doing, um, I don't know, something with this backpack and another fox because it's just really cute. Oh, you enjoyed it. I'm so glad, Brain Seer. Thank you so much for being here. Like I said, it was a very chill stream today. I'm going to figure out, like, background music, I think. If I could figure out it not copywriting me. <laughs> Even though I don't have my channel monetized, it still gives me copyrights and stuff. You're going to choose Pua. Yes, Pua's cute. I feel like Pua is a good choice. People always vote for pictures with Pua in it. Calico rabbit. Yay. But you had birds flying in the background. Oh, that's going to be really cute. Yeah, I got to look through all my companions. Decide who's my favorite. And I guess make an outfit. <laughs> Rapunzel. Really? I just don't like her pose, you guys. <laughs> oh, it's so funny, though. She opens her eyes. She's like, are you looking at me? Hey, <laughs> it's it's so funny. <laughs> Well, I hope you guys have a good rest of your Wednesday. I think tomorrow. So, oh yeah, please post in Discord. Please do. I am really bad at telling you guys that I have a Discord. We'll do that. <laughs> if you guys haven't joined the Discord, feel free. It's not super active. I am still learning Discord, so. <laughs> but we can post our dream snaps over there, which is fun. And talk about them. So I need to post last week's dream snap. I don't like I don't like my villain dream snap, but it's yeah, fine. It's fine. <laughs> uh but yeah, tomorrow's stream, I think I'm gonna do an evening stream. I never do evening streams, but I think I'm gonna be able to do it. I don't know exactly what time yet. It's gonna be either around six or seven um PM Eastern. So no daytime. We're going to try evening for one day just for fun. Maybe I'll work on the meadow or maybe we'll work on the castle. Can I move it? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, that's a great little like shot, little alleyway right there. That's cute. So maybe we'll work on the, the castle tomorrow, but I'll let you guys know. I will post about it. So thank you guys so much for hanging out. I hope that you have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. And yeah, another chill stream tomorrow. You won't be able to. That's okay. You know, I do appreciate everybody that rewatches. If you guys can't make it live, but you rewatch, that really helps the channel. So thank you so much. And I appreciate that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, guys, I hope you have a wonderful day. My goodbyes are so long. I don't know how to end. I just say goodbye, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> but I hope you have a wonderful day. And uh, oh, what time? I don't know yet. It's it's going to be sometime between 6 and 7 p.m. Eastern. But I will try and post. I'll try and schedule it tomorrow morning um, once I've narrowed down 
the time exactly. So I'm not used to streaming in the evening, so that'll be... Oh no, Ursula's here. There she goes. <laughs> It'll be interesting to see what time we do, but I'll make sure I post about it so you guys know. Okay, guys. He's so cute. This is actually cute. Oh, I was going to take a picture and then I closed my eyes. He looks really cute right now. We have to take a picture. Oh my gosh. Oh, that's cute. Okay, I'm going to save that. <laughs> I don't know what I'll do with it. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello? That was a jump scare. Uh, but yeah, I will see you guys later. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. And thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I'll see you next time. Bye. Oops.